Yeah, and Lisa, like a soccer game decided by penalty kicks, high drama right now inside City Hall. You got lawmakers, uh, FC Cincinnati, Oakley Community Council representatives, and citizens kicking around the mayor's funding plan for a new soccer stadium. The decisive discussion comes after last night's vote by Oakley Community Council objecting to the $37 million city plan, saying Oakley doesn't want all of its tax increment financing used up. It's a key part of Mayor Cranley's formula. He is now willing to scale back two and a half million of it, and we'll speak of, about that in a little while. There was nothing slam dunk about the council vote anyway. Oakley's position has certainly magnified that uncertainty. Cranley among the most interested observers as the public comments today, and he's armed with a letter supporting his plan from former Mayor Mark Mallory. Major League Soccer awards two cities an expansion team in a couple of weeks. That deadline itself carries controversy. FC Cincinnati should have spoken up much sooner. Uh, if they had their act together, they knew what the deadline would be, and they should have brought their proposal to council to the public a lot sooner than two weeks before the deadline. One citizen uh, inside City Hall used the word boondoggle. Another gushed with enthusiasm about the benefit to Oakley if they can get a stadium there. The mayor is now looking to make a move that uh, he thinks will be more palatable to more members of council by saying, hands off two and a half million uh, of the Madison Road TIF, but that leaves him his funding plan short. So we'll see how the vote goes. Live at City Hall, John London, WWT News 5.